Jackie Robertson went to the major leagues, I was picking cotton beside my dad, and I said to myself, here's my way out of the cotton field. Playing in the Negro League, the guys heard my voice, and they said, man, if you make a lot of money singing, you sing pretty good. They say that time will heal all wounds in vice and men. As a little boy, Charlie Pride learned the language of country music. Yes, it the both are down in Louisiana, just about a mile from a Texan. And then both a cotton field bag on He didn't take any classes in this, there weren't any. He was like, I'm gonna be a country singer and I belong here. No person of color had ever done what he was doing. There were a lot more obstacles in front of Mr. Pride's dream. You had to want to get there and you had to go for it. If I can get in front of him, he don't care nothing about no pigmentation. Charlie's a fighter for one. He's not afraid to kind of do things his own way, kind of be a trailblazer. It's an angel, good morning. And over like the devil when you get back home. It was just a novelty, you know, to have a, a black man singing country music. And the fact that he sang it so much better than so many of the good country artists were at the time. He was the biggest selling RCA artist next to Elvis in history. Who is Charlie Pride? What, what do you want? Charlie deserves every accolade he can get. We'll make up some new ones if we need to. I'm just 